Man to man is so unjust. Children, ya don't know who to trust. Your worst enemy could be your best friend. And your best friend, your worst enemy. Some will eat and drink with you, drink with you. And behind them, susu upon you now, susu upon you. And your night will turn you day now. And a lot of people will run away. Yeah. And who's the cap fit? Let them wear it. Big up, everybody. Thank you very much for checking me out. The scene you just saw as an expert who is good in giving estimate in roofing. Yes, I know you would say that echo. I have seen this video, I've seen this building on your channel. Tell me about it. Okay, so two, three years ago, I was contacted by a brother uh, who is living in the USA, but a Jamaican. He said, echo. I see a lot of things that you do trying to bring, trying to bridge the gap between Africans in diaspora and Africans here on the motherland. Echo, I, I want to move to the motherland, but I don't want to be among the African American community or the African uh, diaspora community. I just want to mingle with my people. So can you help me out? I was like, big brother, don't worry, I got your back. I get your back. So this is the result of our final conversation. Yes. So I am here today. Today is Friday, 24th of May, 2024. I came here uh, with an expert who is good with giving estimate as to uh, the number of roofing sheet that we will need uh, to fill up the place. You can see him over there doing his work. Yes, this is what we are here to do right now so let me give you a little tour about this project um this is a two-story if i should call it that way it's a it's a, it's a two-story uh oh how many rooms i have forgotten <laughs> anyway so uh the last time i came we hadn't gotten to the roof inside yet uh we were still working down here you know doing the flow uh i mean the from the lentil going up because i remember the time when i came they were putting, you know, wood here so that they, could, they can put the uh, concrete in it to uh, fix the lentil. So this time, I think after a month's time, I am here and the roofing is about to go down. All right. So let me take you down there and also see what is happening there. I am very happy. When I started this video, I, I, did, I, I did sing a song. I mean, that song to me is the reality that Africans are beginning to trust each other. Africans are beginning to come together. When I say Africans, I'm talking about brothers and sisters from the diaspora or in the diaspora to brothers and sisters in the motherland. Yes, things are happening. A lot of things are happening. I am glad that at least I am playing a role and this connection. This leads to my dream of visiting any Caribbean island this year. Um, it has been my dream for some time now. Uh, it hasn't come into reality yet because, uh, you know, it is difficult to get in a flight straight from Africa to 
the Caribbean. You would have to go through our slave master's uh, land. Uh, you either go through UK or go through the US or Europe. And before you could do that, you will need a transit visa. And the transit visa also comes with its own uh, whatever, whatever. So I know that Wadamaya is organizing uh, a, a, a trip from Ghana to Barbados. It's a chartered flight. I think this brother is really... Now, I'm walking here, breathing in good, fresh air. Why? Because I have all these awesome plants here. You can see here we have oranges, we have lime all over the place. How would that be for you when you are living in such a place? Yes, yeah, so like I said, Wadamaya is trying to put up, or he's putting up a project where he's uh, sending about 250 people from the motherland to the Caribbean. Isn't this what Kwame Nkrumah, Marcus Gavi, and all other Pan-Africans were looking for? So I think this is the best time to support this brother do what he's doing. Uh, I met him a month ago when he came to Ghana. You know, he brought the, um, um, the wife and then the father and the brother to Ghana, to Cape Coast, my city, the beautiful city in the world. And he called me up and said, hey, Eko, um, I'm here. Come, let's hang around. And at the end of the day, Wadamaya is inviting me to join this trip. But it comes with money. It's about $4,999 to join this trip. $4,999 to join a chartered flight from Ghana to Barbados. I wish I had that money, man. But let's see. So I am here today just to give you uh, a beautiful scenery of the project that I am embarking. Yes, I did uh, get him this plot. I did help him clear the land. I did help him uh, get water borehole. I did help him get this thing running so i am very happy today you can see i'm sweating ghana is pretty hot right now still we're in the rainy season you can still have some days that is like pretty hot and it's early in the morning yes friday 24th of may 2024 like i told you it's early in the morning and look at the brother he's still working he's busily working doing his thing yep This is tick. They call this one tick. I think they use this. Who is that talking down there? Okay. Mind you, the community is just over there. So this is um, Afrengwa. Afrengwa is where I teach, where I work for the past 16 years. So uh, when the brother told me, oh, I need a place, I'm like, hey. Afringwa is an awesome place. That is a community down there. Just over there. I wish I brought my drone. I didn't bring it. I would have done some few shots. Okay, so uh, this place wasn't also there. We had to uh, make the road. And that is cost intensive. Because we cleared the first one. Cars couldn't come up. We had to clear again. And now, I think it's pretty cool. Because of the rains, we are in a rainy city. So you see some gutters being created over here. But as in when... Uh, there's the need for us to fix something we will have to fix it so this is this this is a two plot of land uh, i think 80 by 90 yeah 80 by 90 yeah two of them so he's building on the top most of the land up there okay and uh like i said we have we already did the borehole for him this is the borehole so he pumps water straight into the polytank over there there's a polytank over there and there's a generator that pumps the water from here all the way to that side so I'm very happy that I've been part of this project and yesterday I was talking to my brother I call him my brother he's, he's like maybe he's my big brother I call him my big brother I was like hey big brother you know this project is my it's my personal project because anytime I say that then he's laughing because he sees the energy that I put in in trying to make sure that we do the right because this brother that we as we as we I brought today, he was supposed to. We spoke yesterday, evening, and he's about three to four hours from from where this land is. He's coming from Accra, somewhere behind Accra. 
and then he's like if you guys are ready i'll come i said come come so i sent him his transportation and he's here here to work i'm really sweating and i'm really tired but i'm happy because i'm breathing fresh air there's mango you remember the famous mango that i told you about so this is his room this will be one of his rooms maybe the master bedroom somewhere there and then you get up and then you have mango just behind you beautiful so uh Ephraima. okay i heard someone talking i thought he called me so you have uh popo too here this brother is lucky and that the, the thick trees oh my god so you know don't mind the inside normally when they are working they leave the place dirty like that and after that they just uh, you know clean it up I like the designs of the of this one the column this I think there's gonna be a hole here it's gonna be a big hole a big hole with a, a room here and I'm gonna have my own room. <laughs> yeah, so shout outs to you. I don't wanna mention your name because some of these things you need to keep it private. So shout outs to you, brother, for believing in me. Um, at some point, we're all slowing down a little bit, but we are up. We're up and we are about to, 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 to play the game. So I honestly wanna say that uh, there are a lot of people you can trust. There are a lot of uh, good people out there in Ghana, in Africa, that you can trust, you can give your money to to embark on some project for you but there needs to be that constant communication don't just put the money there and be like i know he's doing it no be on constant communication and don't be angry sometimes you know sometimes we all need to be patient in i want to tell you something in africa in ghana patience is the key patience is the key anyway But we need to clean this place. It's too dirty. <laughs> I was trying to <laughs> I was trying to justify why the place is dirty, but it's too dirty. So we either have to find someone. No, the main worker should, should do that. You have to clean the place. Okay. So they fix all the electricals. As you can as you can see. I was just jumping. As you can see, you can see all the electrical work being done. I think they fix this place so that they can sleep here. Because they can't be going and coming every day, so they fix this place. Maybe they sleep here, I'm sure, because see mosquito net here. They're trying to sleep here. Yeah. The place is very dirty, they have to clean it. Look at all this shit. This shit must be clean. Okay, there's another room. Okay, so I think they were sleeping here and there. I mean, they have to sleep here because they, 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 they don't. They are not from here, so they can't be going and coming every day. Look, look at them uh, orange trees. There is there is one Bob Marley song that I love so much. It says. Um, Unto the philosophy which old one raise inferior and another inferior and finally and permanently discredited and abandoned everywhere is war. You see one 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 verse that, that really touches my heart he says until there's no longer first class and second class citizens of any nation until the color of a man's skin is of no more significance than the color of his eyes 
I'm a Zawar. <laughs> I am just happy. The connection is coming. I've been talking to Jamaicans. I, I, don't, I never even dreamt of me chilling with Jamaicans. Like, you know, getting calls from Jamaicans. Hey, you call me Jamaican. I'm living in Germany. I'm living in here. I'm living in there. I want to I wanna move to the motherland, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, hey, um, we are moving. We are really moving. So let me go up and see what the brother is doing. And then we gonna take it from there. Okay. Yes, sir. Uh, oh, wait a minute, sir. What's it? What's it? Uh huh. Say, ah. Slope, no. Uh huh. Say, ah. Say, ah. Say, Oh. And she says, no, my answer, I no advice, Ben, you bet me, I have Okay. 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 Uh -huh. Okay. And you do any size, no? And say, do any size. I'm on cut it. Um, uh huh. Cut it in Okay. To move in the back, I bet she more. I bet she more. Okay. It's in so good one. Who see ya? Now farm. So now I'm going to shoot in this one. Okay. Now, okay. That's another talent. This is a plus train. Okay. We got to tell you plus train. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right. So the brother also gave some recommendations as to what would work for the roofing if he wins the 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 bed so usually you have two or three people come and look at it and then they all give their quotes and then you pick the one that you want to pick if i'm living here i wake up in the morning i just bring my my seat here put my table and chair roll some herb <laughs> enjoy myself because you have look can't get this thing anywhere, bro. Can't get you can only get this here. Here. Okay, so guys, I think my guy is done and uh say where we okay. My guy is done, so we're gonna leave and then whatever updates that would come, I will let you know. Alright? Peace out and take good care of yourself. And very soon you'll find me in the Caribbean. Yes, with the Caribbean thing. So what am I is doing it? Uh you're to me awkward. What am I is doing it? And uh, like I said, I want to be a part of it. So if you feel like, hey, Echo, I want to support you with $100, okay? Put it together and maybe find some elsewhere so you can get your $4,099 um, dollars. Then uh, I'll be able to experience and bring you some stuff from the Caribbean. But aside that, I'm stuck in here trying to help support uh, my brothers and sisters who want to move down here.
everywhere is green. Everywhere is green. Everywhere is green. Everywhere is green. Hey, so we didn't get a car on our way back from the land here. So we decided to pick a, a motorbike. 